So in today's video, we're going to talk about what are the benefits of becoming a HOA or a condominium association board member. So why would you ever think of becoming a board member is what a lot of people always ask me. But in reality, there are many benefits that you would get and your association can gain from by becoming a board member. The first benefit is really being able to give a sense of direction to your community if it doesn't have one. So if you're a resident and you feel that your association is not moving in the right direction, as a board member, you're able to provide that guidance and that vision, obviously communicating with your residents as well, on what direction the association should be taking. The next item that you will benefit by becoming an association board member is gaining additional leadership skills. Serving on an association board is really a thankless job and you do not get paid for what you do, but ultimately you are able to sharpen your skills or sharpen your knife in being a stronger leader. You're gonna have to deal with the management company if you have a management company. If you're a self-managed board, you'll have to be dealing with the contractors, dealing with contract, dealing with insurances. So it's gonna show you how not only to deal with people, but how to negotiate. So it'll help you sharpen your leadership skills. Next, which is a very important one, is building stronger relationships. You'll be able to build stronger relationships uh, within the community, get a better understanding of what your neighbors are looking for within the community, why they moved into the community, and ultimately build some good relationships with other individuals that live in the same community and possibly have the same vision that you have. Next is also improving your financial understanding of how to manage a budget how to manage the association's financials. So this is an opportunity for you to sharpen your skill sets or improve them, or even get a better understanding of how things work. Sitting as, let's say, the treasurer, ideally you want someone with experience, but that isn't always the case. So hopefully you'll have a management company to really provide you some guidance and understanding of how the financials work. And if you're that board member that didn't have that strong of financial background, you'll be able to gain that knowledge from the management company or the partner that you're working with. So sitting on the board, you can get definitely some financial experience. And lastly, and what I like to call most importantly, is really making a difference within your community. Many times we get stuck on the challenges of living within a community, but there are many benefits to live within a community association. As a board member, you're able to make that positive change in your community, whether it be by simple things of just hosting a coffee and donuts with your neighbors, or it could be an extravagant uh, holiday party that you do for all your community members. But ultimately as a board member, you're able to provide really a good positive spin for your community. And from my experience, when you have communities that really know how to lean more on the positive than the negatives, you'll find that you're gonna have much more happier residents. You're gonna find much more sense of community and the values of the community will grow because of that engagement. So in closing, sitting on a board of directors, while we always hear on the news that it's very negative and very challenging, it can actually be very rewarding. A lot of it has to do with the mindset that you put yourself into and also the individuals that you surround yourself, especially the management company or the support structure that you have within your community. So if you're considering running for the board, I highly suggest you do so. It's the only way to really create change or in certain instances, create additional improvements based on what's been done in the past. If you need assistance in really getting a strong partner to help you execute that vision that you have as a board or as a potential board member, I invite you to visit our website, managedbyaffinity.com. We'll be happy to have a sit down and see if we're a match for your particular community. If you've liked this video, please make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also make sure to give us two thumbs up. We look forward to seeing you in our next video.